So this is, is this the uh, boundary layer or contact layer area? I don't know, you're the expert. Oh well, <laughs> that's underwater, not, not above ground. Yeah, show, show my viewers what this contact layer Dave was describing in the class looks like. So we got like three contact layers right here. We got our upper contact layer, kind of in the, actually you can see where it's sloughing off underneath of it. Yeah. Kind of right through here, that's your top layer. And then your next layer down here is this kind of sandy, pea gravelly stuff. Yeah. And that holds pretty good gold. And uh, once you get underneath that, you run into this this orange clay layer here. And we're getting gold out of that also. And this should be the top of this orange clay layer. And we're getting pretty good gold on it. So we're pretty convinced that on the bottom of this orange clay layer, it should be really good too, especially if it's sitting on the bedrock. No telling how, how thick that layer is yet. No telling. No telling. But I think we're going to find out. Well, we'll do a little sample pan. Where, what, what layer do you think I should sample, Derek? I think you should sample probably right here, this top layer, and, and kind of where music here is digging. The sandy so stuff? Under, yeah. Try a little of that. And we'll get that cleaned yeah. up, and that way we can uh, maybe if we have to, you know, this is kind of an outing situation, so we're going to end up running it all. But if I was out here working it by myself, I would sample each one of these layers individually and find out where the gold's coming from. Um, in this case, fortunately, we know that there's gold coming from all three layers, so it should be pretty good. Of course, there might be more gold in one layer than, than another, but uh, for all intents and reasons with the outing, you know, we got enough people would run it all, and we'll have, a, we'll have a good cleanup. You think we'll be digging mostly from down lower, or we'll do some digging up here for the uh, group outing? I think we would, we would prefer to get a lot of buckets from up here. I'm up here. Yeah. The mossing down below, is, there's decent gold in it, but it takes half hour to get a bucket. We'll see so, how tomorrow goes then. Yeah. yeah Excellent. Good. Thank you. And at all now, if there's any gold in there. <laughs> if there's any gold in well, there. Well, better for his video. <laughs> a little panning lesson from the master himself. <laughs> and you still don't, I still don't check it when it's this, this little. Yeah. That way. I guess. Way down there. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you believe that? Some guy's like, yeah, those are fire ants. You got to watch out for those. I was like, I'm pretty sure I know what fire ants look like. And they didn't look like them. He's like, they are. What's your name, Pilgrim? Augie. Augie, where are you from? St. Louis. St. Louis Mo. Yep. Came out here just for the class? Yeah, a little bit of that and a little bit of dredging, hopefully, if it ever comes back. Outstanding. Yeah. There's some gold right there. The little edge there. Right there. Yeah. That one? Down at the edge. Yeah. Little speck. See? Fly poop. That's a piece of lead right there. That's a piece of lead. See sitting up there? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. There's three or four pieces of lead. And a piece of lead, or, and that's probably not mercury. Sometimes if you get a really heavy piece of gold, it's covered with it's it's like it's like yeah. I saw one the other night at camp. Some dude was panning. I wish I were uh, sluicing. Okay, well, I got my little sample from up top where they had found a little contact layer. And I classified it down to about a number eight. Pretty fine, easy enough to pan out. So we'll pan it out, and I'll show you if I get any colors. I will try and show you some panning, but it may not be that effective. And now we must wait our turn. Sorry. in that splash. Was there? I think so.
you from, Pilgrim? Arizona. Arizona, have you found a few colors so far today? Yeah, I got a couple chunkers and a few flakes. Outstanding. Nice. Yep, not too bad. Looking for a nugget. Yeah, there we go. No, uh, no, I don't. Yes, I did. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I wouldn't want you going off thinking I had this. I retraced my steps to the scene of the crime. Okay. Let's see if we get a little speck or two of gold in here. seeing anything so far. Not look good in scoop number one. Tiny, tiny, tiny little speck right there. What we call fly poop. I'm not even sure if you'll be able to see it or not, but it's extremely small. It's barely even a color. So we're trying the next scoop. And if I get something, I'll show you the result. <laughs> 